زیرا حقیقتا اگر به ترجمه به نظر هر story in the bible that is in act chapter 8 verse 2 to 40 so it tells the entire story in that chapter 2 nothing makes sense in the story like first of all we have this character we have this person reality person person female who worship God who follow God who preach about God who do who follow about God who the following God who love God who worship God who is a follower and then we get those people who murder him and why is God let something happen like why he didn't stop the murder like why he didn't stop the hopefully that was happening to his followers like he was a follower so we didn't stop him so after that happened a lot of Jews, well, like, a lot of Jews, the people who know from that area, they had to run away. Yeah, they were afraid who like, killed Stephen. Well, killed them too, just because they were Christian. So they run away, and they are all fighting about the message of Jesus to cry all over it, all different places. And at that time, there was just a city that hated each other. Like, they wanted to choke each other neck so bad that they hated each other. The once those news start breaking in and out about you take Christ, the mention about you take Christ all over around those areas, those two cities became like friends. They they started working to watching to watch up together, they were blessing God, they were blessing God together, they were following you take Christ together, they were like all together, team together, you know? They were watching God, they were celebrating God you know, together. Where before they hated each other so bad. But that was before the demon died. And after he died, the Jews seemed to become together. It's that worshiping God. It's that praising God. And so, when you can read the story, as you go around reading the story, that's the, that's the what happened, the situation there, doesn't make any sense, right? So I want you to say that when life does not make any sense, when you can, like your brain cannot comprehend of what was happening, like, that doesn't make sense, like, nothing in my life makes me sense. I don't understand it. I don't know what's happening. Something like that, I want you to say that. That is usually because of God is up to something, and it will be good. It will bring blessing, it will bring murder, it will bring freedom, it will bring healing. It will be so blessed, it will be so good. It will, so again, once again, when things doesn't make sense, doesn't make sense in life, if you God is up to something, it's very wonderful, my little school, my blessing. He will bless you. So, I want you to say that do not give up on God. Just because life doesn't make any sense. God is up to something that will be wonderful for you. That will be genial, wonderful, pretty, and so good that He will provide you something really good. So, that's what I want you to say. And have a great, blessing, good afternoon. Bye.